things, and that's something that certainly the the ITV would not have been able to go through. Today, it takes five or six Marines to get somebody wounded off the battlefield. With something like this, you could do it with one, and that keeps more Marines in the fight. We are testing out the LS3. It's a robotic mule. It's real easy to control, really easy to understand, and uh, it's a whole lot of fun. You can pretty much teach anybody in the military to use it. They're walking through just simple patrol maneuvers uh, with the machine to see where what its limits are and, and where, where it makes most sense for it to be uh, when the squad is on patrol. Experimentation phase is in, in full swing right now. Then we'll come back and we'll look at all the data. We'll get the feedback from all the Marines on how they feel. Uh, it can support them best. And then we'll look at what it needs to look like, what right looks like at the end of the day for a, uh, a legged support system that's autonomous. Uh, just working with robotics, it's not really something that I envisioned doing at any point or working with any kind of experimental technology and just doing it is 